What's going on, 5.30? Hope you guys enjoyed your Mother Day, Mother's Day weekend. Also hope you weren't too sore after that Mother's Day workout. I had a couple complaints, but uh, they only came from my mom. All right, let's, let's get ready. Find some room, get your dumbbells, towel, water, med ball, pillow, whatever you got. It's a little windy. Hopefully it doesn't blow over my computer, but I'm gonna get that timer started. Follow me for the warm up. Alright, here we go. Starting with squats and bringing a knee across. Remember, work on keeping that chest up. Butt back and eyes up. Get a good rotation and dips and core. Bring that knee up. All right, we're gonna stick with squats. Then we're gonna go into a quad stretch. Finding your balance and then switching. More squat in there. Good. All right. Hop down. T rotations. Getting that full rotation of the upper body. And stretching the chest out. All right, on your backs. Gonna warm up the lower abs a little bit. Flutter kicks. Lock those knees out. About six inch kicks. Relax the neck and the head. Keep that lower back down. Remember to breathe. All right, we're going to stay down here. And now alternating knee hugs. Pull the toes towards you. Back flat. Still relaxing the neck. Don't pull your neck up. Nice and relaxed. Okay. Line opposites on all fours. Keep pointing the right leg, point the left arm. We switch once you're steady. All right, good. Stand up. High kicks. Keeping the legs straight. All posture.
lowering that kick if you're beginning to bend the knee. Pushing the heel away, pulling the toe. All right, heel scoops. Sticking to those hamstrings. Reaching all the way up. Take your time. Slowly down your leg. Fully extend up. All right, back down. Mountain climbers, but to the outside of the elbow. So I want you to turn towards that knee. A little bend in the oblique. Keep that knee high. Hips up. All right, last one. Let's loosen up. High knee skips. Get those knees above your waist. Bouncing on the balls of your feet. Flex your toe at the top. All right. Warm up done. Sun's starting to come out a little bit. All right. We're going to start with the Tabata. Today we're going to go 25 seconds on with 15 seconds of rest. And we're going to start with the Dumbbell Glute Bridge March. You're just going to hold the dumbbell above your chest. No movement, just a hold. This will be in a glute bridge. Pushing the heel away. Alternating. Locking those hips up. Flexing the glutes. Okay, and then the second part, swimmers. Just like on Sunday, quads up, knees up, arms straight. But now, we're going around, bringing the arms close to the armpits, and pushing straight out, no towel. Around, out. Keeping all four limbs off the ground, okay? Three times, 25 seconds on, 15 seconds off. All right, here we go. Grab your dumbbell. Get into that glute bridge hold. We're kicking one leg out at a time. Go. Pull that toe towards you. We flex that leg when you straighten it. Flex it into the glute and even in the quad while still keeping those hips. Nice and high. A couple more. Good. Flip over. Swimmers. The only thing that should be on the ground is your stomach and hips. Quads, knees, chest, off the ground. Go. Here we can point the toes and fully straighten those arms out at the top. Nice. 
Bring it back. The weight should be in your heels and in your shoulders. Go. Try not to let your body sway or rock side to side. Core is locked in. Good, we're halfway. Back to swimmers. Full extension. Arms and legs. Pull them apart. Ten seconds. Keep that form. Off the ground. All right. Last round. Here we go. Hips are nice and high. Lock in the glutes. Focus on the glutes, that's where you want the burn. The flexing of quads on extension. Arm straight. Good. Last 25. Keep yourself up. The entire time, don't drop to that last bell. Here we go. Ten seconds. Fully extend. Point. Point. Good. Nice job, gang. Should be nice and loose. All the joints nice and stretched out. All the tendons ready to work. All righty. What we got next? 30, 60, 90. 30 seconds of Russian twists. We know what that is. When we're sitting on our butt with the med ball, or dumbbell, feet up or feet on the ground and rotating our core back and forth. For the minute, we have a dumbbell press with the V-sit hold. We haven't done this yet. We're gonna have our feet up, trying to keep them as straight as we can, pushing the heels away, and we're gonna press up right from the chest and straight out. Okay, if you need to, you can bend the knees or rest the heels down. Okay? That's for the minute. And for the 90, we've got an AMRAP, five heel clicks, and 10 mountain climbers. Jumping up and touching the feet in the middle. If you're not doing that, just give me squats and regular mountain climbers, 10 times, five each leg. All right, let's go. All right, Russian twist first. Feet up or on the ground, keep those feet together though. Go. Try to keep that lower back straight too. Don't curl over. Poke the chest out. Chin up. We're still making sure to look to each side. Five seconds. Good. 
Good. Grab the dumbbell or med ball. We sit, hold with the chest press. One minute. Remember, you can bend your knees or rest the feet on the ground. So let's try to challenge ourselves. Start out with the tougher one. Remember to flex those feet. Slow your breathing down. Start to feel it in your quads. 30 seconds. Step back straight. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Tough one. All right, get ready for the AMRAP. 90 seconds. Five squats for five heel clicks with 10 mountain climbers as many times as possible. 90 seconds straight. Time to compete. Remember to breathe. Ready. Here we go. Landing with soft knees. Drive these knees into your chest. Minute to go. Solid form. I'm on there. Forty seconds. Final push, come on. Dig deep. Ten seconds. Whatever you got left. Good time. Nice job, nice job. Woo. Grab water. That minute V sit. That took a lot out of me. Great working. What we got now? All right, a three part Tabata. 20 seconds on this time, 15 second break. Woo. Everyone's favorite squat jacks for the first 20. Plank jacks for the second, and renegade rows for the third. Three times through. I'll go through all of them real quick. Plank jacks, feet together, dropping down, touching the ground, alternating each time. Keeping those heels down, chest up. It's not a straight leg, bend those knees, get the butt down. Then we have plank jacks. Push up position, feet apart, feet together, hopping on those toes. If you're not hopping, step out. It's that third part again. Renegade rows, grab the dumbbells, heavy or light. 
Feet slightly wider than the shoulders, rowing straight up. If you're not doing renegade rows, shoulder taps instead. Let's go. All right, 10 seconds. Focus up. Squat jacks first. Got to have good form here. First round. Make sure you're touching the ground too. No shortcut. 10 seconds. Butt back. Three, two, one. Plank jacks. Hands directly under your shoulders the entire time. Keeping those hips up. All we're moving is our feet. Go. Feet together. And then feet as far apart as your shoulders. Let's go. Part three. Renegade rows. Lock those hips in. Fight that urge to rock. Back and forth. We're only moving our hands here. Rowing that arm back. No twist. Nice job, round one done. Two to go. Squat jacks. Let's up the intensity, up the number. Go. Squatting all the way down. We're making sure we stand all the way back up. In between. Strong posture all the way down and up. Good, plank jacks. Don't force your feet too wide. Just as wide as your shoulders. Go. We want the abs doing the work here. Not so much our back or hips. So keep those feet close. Renegade rows. Body nice and still. I'd rather you have low reps with perfect control than high reps and moving. Keep it tight. Got it. Third round. Stay loose. Let's work. Come on. Bounce. Let's go. Two more. Let's get it, plank jacks. Improve here. More reps. Quick feet, quick hops. Get to that bell. Don't stop. All right. Here we 
gather your breath here. Solid round. Strict form. Does work. There we are. Tough, tough round. You guys are in this break. Get your water, shake it off, relax a little bit. But we are back to the 30, 60, 90. First 30, kickouts or walkouts. For the minute, we got a wall sit, but I want you to bring a dumbbell or your two light dumbbells with you, and we're doing bicep curls. While we're in the wall sit, try to take that focus off the legs. And then for the 90, we got med ball or pillow knee skips 10 times with 10 split jumps or 10 back lunges. All right, let's start with that 30. Kickouts or walkouts. Up. Let's go get ready. Kick out. Come on. Or walk out. Just make sure that you get your entire foot or both heels underneath you before you stand up. You don't want to push yourself back up on your toes. Get your legs underneath you. Couple more. Okay, grab those dumbbells. Find a wall. Wall sits with bicep curls. I'm gonna disappear over here. Starting at 15, watch the clock. Ready, go. Strict bicep curls. Engage the core. And we're breathing. Thirty seconds. Nadia, you better be working. Twenty seconds. Holding strong in that wall sit. Remember, we're not dropping. Push yourself back up. Five, four, three, two. One, we're up. Nice job. A little longer break. Take your time. Put those dumbbells away. But now we're grabbing a, a med ball or pillow. Ten knee skips. Ten split jumps or back lunges. And we're up. Ninety second and we're up. Time to work, time to compete. Here we go. Back lunges or split jumps. That's five each leg. Right back to knees. Good 
Ready to go. I'm one. Thirty seconds. Good posture, chest up. In the knees and lunges. Don't hunch over. Ten seconds. Finish. Another one done. Nice work. Back to Tabata. For this Tabata, oh, we got some, we got some kicks. Three rounds, 25 seconds on, 15 off. Crab kicks, and then bear crawl kicks. I'll demonstrate both real quick. Crab kicks first, rest for 15, bear crawl kicks, full, full extension on both, let's go. Twenty-five on, fifteen off, pushing with that heel. Pulling the toe towards you. Let's go. They're flexing those hips up. Put some weight on the glute. And try to keep that foot that's on the ground flat on the ground. All right, bear crawl kicks. Hands lined up under the shoulders. Extending that heel as far as you can. Lock that leg out. Good. Flip it over, round two. Come on. Let's get better. Go. Engage the abs. Make your abs work here. Give them something to do. Put a slight focus on them. Halfway mark. <coughs> Let's get it. Push. Woo. Oh, that's getting me. Let's go. Last round. Refocus, tighten it up. Always better than the round before.
You're still moving. Come on. Throw those hips up. Get that heel out there. All right. Try to shake those arms out a little bit. Let's do it. Last 25. Come on. Ten seconds. Form. There we go. That was rough. All right. Water break. Catch your breath. Slow it down a little. Our last thing, our last event, 30, 60, 90. Simple moves, but they're gonna burn. All right, 30 seconds, scissor kicks. Laying flat on our back, sitting on our hands, and our feet are alternating over each other. 60 seconds of plank get-ups. You may need a mat for this. Starting on the elbows, feet shoulder width apart or a little wider. Up, up, down, down. Alternating lead hands. That's the minute. And you already know what the 90 is. Wall sit. Straight up wall sit. No winding, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get it. 30 second scissor kicks. Minute plank get ups, 90 second wall sit. Come on. Oh, lucky you. Timer. There we go. 10 seconds. We're getting the full amount of time. Guys, let's go. Don't cut it short. Relax the neck. Lock the legs out. Pull the toes towards your head. Lower back. Glue to the ground. Pick up speed. Coming to the end. All right. Plank get ups. One minute. If you do get too tired, drop to your knees first. But I want everybody starting on their hands and feet. Go. You gotta go somewhere else in your head for this one. Try to keep those hands underneath the shoulders. It's going to make it harder to push back up. If your back's starting to get a little sore, slowly go to the knees. If you took a break, take your time coming back. But do come back. we got 10 seconds. One more up. Let's go. 90 second wall sit. I can't see you, but everybody's finishing. 
I want 90 degree angles in the knees. Hamstrings parallel to the ground. Feet flat, arms hanging. That's talking to you, Nadia. Let's go. Oh man, we got a minute left. I hope nobody slid down to the ground or was creeping up. We're still in that first position we started in. Legs shaking yet? We got 30 seconds. We know we're not done. Fight for it. Woo! 15. 10 seconds. Five, four, push yourself back up. Good. That's what's up. 5.30, we have come to an end.